I heard the story of a young man who was very intelligent, looking for an oil job. And then somehow, he passed all the stages. And the last stage before he would be given his letter was the stage when he's going to appear before the chairman one-on-one. -on -one. So they brought the name and the chairman began to ask, whose name is this? From which family? So when the young boy entered, the man asked him a question. Intelligent, one of the best that came for that interview. And the man said, sorry, is this your name? He said, yes. Which state? He said, which? And the boy spoke and spoke and until they discovered, the man discovered that this is the son of the man who made a vow, who wasted the family. He only escaped. And he said to him, sorry, we were from us. That was how an intelligent young boy was deprived. My father didn't leave houses for me. My father didn't leave money for me. But my father left a good name. That even in America, a woman saw my children and said, We am in America today because years ago your father helped us to escape. And did to my children what my father never did. Church, a good name can be better than riches. A good name. If some people who have been left you before have a reason to write your story, heaven bear witness, many of them will still write your goodness. Even if they don't like you, they still know the role you played in their life. There is a junction that we get to where hunger will show that we knew that when they were with you, they were never hungry because you constantly fill in the gap for them. 